Chapter 3 Citizenship Civics Before starting our chapter, let's learn what is civics. Civics is the study of the great theoretical and practical aspects of citizenship, its rights and duties. Rights are the benefits which we get from our government. For example, we have the right to educate, right to travel, right to vote, right to speech, etc. And duties are the responsibility that we have to perform. For example, if we travel, we should not harm or cause damage to sick and any other things. It's also our duty to pay tickets for traveling. The duties of citizens to each other as member of political body and to the government. This is Raju's house. It was Sunday. Raju and his family members were helping each other clean the house. हम भी संडे होता है तो हमारे घर में मम्मी के साथ घर का काम करते हैं. After having tea, Dadaji called Raju. Raju, a family is a social institution which the child comes into contact with first. The child learns about for the very first time from the family. Therefore, family is called the school of culture and personality development. It is the smallest unit of society. सबसे पहले family से ही बच्चा culture सीखता है. जो family में देखता है, वो ही उसे समझता है और वो ही वो खुद भी करता है. A family also teaches that we are mutually depend on each other. Mutually means एक दूसरे पर. For example, mother cook food for whole family, father earn money for all. Thus, we all based on each other. Society is based on the principle of cooperation and it brings with the family. Society bhi ek dusre ke cooperations ke saath judi hui hai. After explaining, uh, Dadaji also tell that we learn, educate and manners from the family. The family and school are institution which shape us into become a better citizen and living a better life. School or uh, family say, hum a better life ji sakte hai. From birth to adulthood, the child comes in contact with many social institutions which help to mold and develop personality. If a child is given opportunity to think and take decisions freely, he will become a good citizen. Dadaji, should the duties performed by each person be for his family alone? Kya? फैमिली के लिए ही हर ड्यूटी होती है। Not at all. You were born in our family and will remain a member of this family. नहीं, ऐसा नहीं। तुम ये फैमिली में बोर्न हुए हो और ये फैमिली के मेंबर हो। It is the duty of your mother and father to nourish and protect you. ये तुम्हारी मदर और फादर की ड्यूटी है कि तुम्हें प्रोटेक्ट करना है और तुम्हारा ध्यान रखना है। Similarly, your first duty is to respect your family, follow the custom and tradition and observe all rules and regulations. और ये तुम्हारी first duty है कि तुम अपने parents का respect करो और अपने family का culture और traditional को follow करो. This is family. One small house is family. This is village. It joined so many house then this is our surat district then this is our state gujarat many or district joined and it can say it a state and Many states joined and became a country. District, state, country, nation. 
this is our globe of world and this is our india this is the map of our india and this is the relation with various institution family village taluka district state country nation and world after listening to everything his dadaji told him rajul joined his mother in cleaning of a cupboard where he found a card on one of the shelves what is this mummy this is water id card of your father it has some information and photograph on it it is the resident proof of the ऑनर ऑफ वॉटर आई डी कार्ड ये वॉटर आई डी है इस पर फोटोग्राफ है और रेसिडेंट प्रूफ है जिसकी वो वॉटर आई डी है इट मस्ट बी विद अ पर्सन एज अ डॉक्यूमेंट फॉर वोटिंग वोटिंग के लिए ये कंपल्सरी डॉक्यूमेंट्स है इन इंडिया ईच एंड एवरी सिटीजन हु इज एटीन ईयर्स और अबाव हैज द राइट टू वोट एटीन ईयर्स से जो भी एज में ऊपर है उनको वोटिंग का राइट है इट इज़ एन ऑथेंटिक डॉक्यूमेंट ऑफ बींग सिटीजनशिप दादाजी प्लीज एक्सप्लेन मी द मीनिंग ऑफ टर्म सिटीजन एंड सिटीजनशिप अब राजू अपने दादाजी से पूछ रहा है दादाजी सिटीजन और सिटीजनशिप के टर्म्स में मुझे बताइए वो दोनों में क्या फ़र्क है A person who legally belongs to a country and has right and protection of that country is a citizen of that country. वो जो भी legally belongs से country से उसको right और protection उस country से मिलता है वो वो country का citizen है And India सी and India citizen has deep love for his country and tells pride in the fact that he is an Indian citizen. एक इंडियन सिटीज़न के लिए इंडिया इंडियन सिटीज़न होना बहुत प्राइड है उसको बहुत गर्व है एक इंडियन होने का ही कॉपरेट विद अदर सिटीज़न एंड सर्व द नेशन एंड इन टर्न द गवर्नमेंट गिव हिम राइट्स टू एंजॉय वो अपने सिटीजन्स के साथ नेशन और गवर्नमेंट ने जो राइट्स दिए हैं वो एंजॉय करता है An ideal citizen never causes harm to the country. एक अच्छा citizen अपने country को कभी भी harm यानी नुकसान नहीं पहुँचाएगा Citizenship. Citizenship means to stay permanently in a country, to enjoy rights given by a state, and to perform the duties entrusted to a person. A person gets or loses a citizen. शेप अकॉर्डिंग टू द रूल्स प्रिस्क्राइब इन द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन ऑफ इंडिया अगर कोई सिटीजनशिप रूल्स को फॉलो नहीं करता है या कुछ भी गलत करता है तो उसकी सिटीजनशिप जा सकती है अकॉर्डिंग टू कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन सिंगल सिटीजनशिप इज गिवन बाई यूनियन गवर्नमेंट टू ऑल सिटीजन ऑफ इंडिया दैट इज सिटीजनशिप ऑफ इंडिया A child who is born in foreign country but has Indian parents has the right to Indian citizenship. A child, अगर कोई foreign country में born होता है और उसके parents Indian हैं तो उसको Indian citizenship का भी right है How to get an Indian citizenship? There are four ways of getting an Indian citizenship. By birth, a person who is born in India gets Indian citizenship automatically. जो India में born हुआ है उसको Indian citizenship automatically मिली हो मिल जाएगी For example, that we all born in India, thus we all are Indian. A child who is born in foreign country but has Indian parents has the right to Indian citizenship. For example, Shri Singh and his wife are both Indian and are staying in U.S. Nadeem, their son is is born. Shri Sheikh registered the name of Nadeem in the office of Indian ambassador. 
the nadim gets the, the citizenship of two countries us and india however when nadim became settled he has the citizenship of any one country of his choice jab nadim uh, us mein uska born hua hai to usko us aur indian dono citizenship mili but when it became adult he wants to choose he, only one country of his choice either us or india by law third by registration fourth by foreigner can acquire indian citizen a foreigner can acquire indian citizen by being a resident for, for more than 5 years 5 saal se zyada agar india mein resident rehte hai wo to surrender the citizenship of a foreign country at the time of application if a foreign man is indian citizen he she that becomes an indian citizen agar koi lady indian man ke sath marry karti hai to use automatically indian citizenship mil jayegi isi tarah koi man india lady ke sath uh, marry kar, karta hai to use bhi indian citizenship mil jayegi if an indian citizen commits serious crime of betrayal then he loses the citizenship of india agar koi dhoka deta hai to use indian citizenship ho ho jayegi dada ji i have got a lot of information about citizen and citizenship from you which i will pass on to all my friends ab राजू अपने दादाजी से कहता है कि दादाजी मुझसे बहुत सारी इन्फॉर्मेशन आपसे मिली है सिटीज़न और सिटीजनशिप के बारे में अब ये सब मैं अपनी फ्रेंड्स के साथ शेयर करूँगा थैंक यू